In the next few years, Ball State plans on building a $26 million hotel slash dorm room slash conference center with commercial space inside. The massive 100,000 square foot project called the McKinley Commons will be located at the corner of McKinley and University Avenues and will house students as well as campus guests and is supposedly geared towards a hands-on experience for hospitality majors. All that sits on the land now is a parking lot, a fenced off construction area, an old Ball State owned bookshop slash apartment, and oh yeah, Hyatt Printing. In a recent court case, Ball State was awarded eminent domain on the property that Hyatt Printing currently owns, which means Hyatt Printing will be forcibly sold to Ball State. Hyatt can now appeal the ruling for a cost of $1 million. I believe this is very sad for Hyatt Printing. They've been around for almost 40 years now on campus. I can't imagine being forced to leave my own business. A compromise, I think, that the judge should have considered, I don't even know if this is possible, but is to allow eminent domain to take place and then inside of the McKinley Commons, where they have the commercial spaces, allow Hyatt Printing to have one of the commercial spaces at the same price that they're currently paying on their property right now. So that way, Hyatt gets to stay in the same location, is still paying the same property prices that they are now, and Ball State gets to have their massive, fancy hotel, dorm room, conference center, McKinley Commons.